Okay, hi folks. Once again, I'm here to tell you that I'm just put together a new video and it's available now to for your viewing pleasure on library LBRY. <laughs> this is my this is my new way to make YouTube videos is just say okay here I am, I'm on, I just made a new video and I put it on my library. Uh, my new video, uh, it's called um, Jesus uh, is going to slaughter all Australian police and cast them into the lake of fire which burneth forever. And so, my video, my new video is, whoop, let me turn my monitor down a second. So my new video is all about um, taking comfort in the fact knowing that the Australian police will be slaughtered and cast into the lake of fire. And I guess my, the other point is I want people to get used to the idea that we've been taught um, that fascism is so evil, fascism. But never communism is so evil. The reason we've been taught fascism is so evil is because the fascists were able to defeat the Bolsheviks. And so I got all kinds of interesting stuff in this new video. I got you know clips from people who've been taken off of YouTube, <laughs> you know, and uh, there's all kinds of great stuff on this. I, I uh, uh, there's a lot of footage of um, the Australian protesters and. Um, how the uh, what well, you see this here in the background here this is the Australian police they take a knee to, to BLM protesters but the handicapped pregnant woman's were sharing a face, Facebook pro, a post about a protest so this double standard is absolutely insane that this is very selective uh, persecution and you know Australia which you know, it used to be a free first world nation, it has now become a communist tyranny. And I don't hear anything about it from the Trump administration or any other, you know, politicians or news organizations in America or anything. It's all just the undergrounders, the truthers on alternative media that are talking about this. Where's the State Department in the United States saying, well, we're going to have to put sanctions on Australia for their human rights violations? Nothing. Not bullshit. Not a peep. It's all bullshit. It's, there's, um, because the United States government is part of that whole Marxist Bolshevik global tyranny that, that that's, although they're starting in Australia, it's coming to, it's coming to a, to an American city near you. You see, I mean, they're, they're taking down, you know, YouTube videos left and right if they're, you know, not promoting, if they're, you know, uh, challenging the Bolshevik narrative. And so, you know, this is, uh, I'm just, you know, I am take a great deal of solace in the fact knowing that Jesus is coming back to cast these uh, Australian police into the lake of fire. I've, you know, I used to be like most people, you know, you're very uncomfortable with the idea of hell. How can God, you know, it seems kind of cruel and unusual and blah, blah, blah. You know what? Praise God for hell. You watch these Australian police and you know why God created hell. Praise God for hell. That's my, that should actually be the name of this video. But, but at any rate, uh, please check me out on LBRY. And, um, you know, as long as I can, I will exploit YouTube for that purpose because, you know, YouTube is part of the Bolshevik Marxist globalist tyranny that's going to destroy your lives. And um, at least we can take some comfort in communicating with uh, each other and speaking the truth on other platforms. Um, and so that's why I'm still here. 
to get you onto uh, some freedom trains. I eventually, here's the thing with um, BitChute. Okay, so they dropped the mandatory reference code, but this referral code, but they still got some other something's wrong. I got to get my computer guy, still can't get on there. So I'm still bad, mouth, bad mouthing BitChute. <laughs> you know, if I ever, if I ever, if they get their act together and let me on, I'll, you know, I'll be on there too. But right now, you know, LBRY is the place. Although, you know, I don't really trust completely LBRY because I know they are of Israeli origin. But right now, they're allowing us free speech, and it's one of the few places left for free speech. So join me on LBRY. And there's lots of good stuff on my latest excursion into the world of truthers. <laughs>